Hi, I'm Knox. Today's topic, sorry, could not connect to Skype. If you look at a list of changes recently released Skype 7.15.0.1024 for Windows, you can notice that this version was added to the text of a new error that should occur if the computer is not connected to the Internet. In such cases, the following error, unfortunately, we could not connect to Skype. Check your Internet connection and try again. However, some users have experienced this error, even when the computer is connected to the Internet and other programs run without problems. Typically, an error occurs after you upgrade to Skype version 7.16.0.101. Please note that this version is obsolete before you begin to resolve the error. Make sure that you have the latest versions of the following programs. So, let's go. If you now is Skype, delete it, preferably after removal. Clean the system files from the old Skype. I do this with a single utility to clean tune up. Skype was removed. We clean the system go on. 1. Check the connection to the server Skype. If ticks are everywhere as I have, it means everything is OK. 2. Install the necessary updates Internet Explorer. If you have a Windows XP download this update, Windows 7.8.10 if the download is from the official website 3. Download the latest version of Skype from the official website and install it. If the error persists, check the firewall, he may be blocking port 80. To do this you need to either disable firewall, as I do, or make Skype on firewall exceptions list. Just install, 1 Adobe Flash Player, 2 Microsoft Net Framework, 3 Microsoft Visual C++, if even then you have Skype is not earned, is the last hope for 100% duty Skype. You can download it via the link which is located below the video, Skype in the archive. For this it will unpack the archive you need WinRAR. If you have not installed on the laptop archive a WinRAR, here's a link to the free download.